Hello guys, welcome to another section of the class today. I read my humble self, Rejoice Fiki, which, whichever you can call. Um, Quickly here, we're going to be talking about Alibaba.com today, okay? So please, I want you to do me a favor. If you don't have Alibaba accounts, make sure that you go on Play Store to download this very app, Alibaba.com, okay? If you have the app already, this is my app, okay? But for the sake of those that are actually new, for the sake of those that are actually new in this, um... I'm actually going to be showing you on how to I'm going to be showing you on how to actually walk through this alibaba.com by opening the app, okay? So, um quickly for those who are actually new, let's use like a space, a dual space. Uh, okay. Um click on Alibaba. For the sake of those who are new that actually don't know how to download it or whatever. So, this is Alibaba, right? Once you download the app, it will sh show you this. This is exactly what it's going to show you. So you click on continue with email. You put in email. Let's say uh, in email is, okay, let's say email is um fikihair.com. Fiki, right? This install, make sure that you install it. Mine's already installed, so I don't know why the notification is still popping up. Okay, so you put in input your first name. If your first name is like mine, which is Rejoice, and your second name is like mine, which is Fiki, uh, you input your own password and blah blah blah. But because I'm not ready to do this or create an account yet, or what once you're done with this, it will actually show you next, right? And that next, it will now show you. Uh, that you should input a code that was sent to you for verification so once you input that code you're done you're already done registering the account okay so that's that guys so let's assume you're done registering the account let's come back to my own personal account which is well registered already okay so you see i clicked on that very my alibaba just like we did in the previous one right you know, here, if you click on my Alibaba, it's going to show you sign in or register because you're not registered yet. But because mine is registered, I click on my Alibaba and showing me Fiki Empire. So actually, I'm well registered. OK, but because you're seeing this, my orders, one on paid process, ship, blah, 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 because actually I have two accounts of Alibaba. And actually this one, most of my payments and everything like I do them on WhatsApp, like I drag my own agents or um, my own suppliers down to WeChat or WhatsApp. OK, I hardly make payments here on alibaba you can as well do that if you don't want to make your payments via alibaba maybe if your supplier actually sells hair and maybe you want to source from that supplier and um, maybe have like a wholesale price more information about that person you want to chat with that person frequently because most hair suppliers are on alibaba actually on whatsapp like 247 like you can actually chat when i say 247 i mean their site because our times are different okay so like here i have like so many unread messages from my so these are people i've actually chatted with suppliers i've been sourcing products for some clients you know via alibaba and stuff like that and my own personal products okay so let's come to home and i'm going to show you how to actually chat with your supplier how to source for your products and everything okay so let's come to home you're going to search for you see um let's say hand bags handbags ladies okay so actually here yeah, it's going to show you different different kind of things let's see if we can actually click on female hand bags Okay, so here you have different varieties of female handbags. Okay, let's just say um, you come to home. I actually want to show you guys some things here. Okay, um, click on all categories. Uh, maybe you want bags and everything. And here it's going to actually show you different varieties of bags. Maybe if you don't want to actually search, it's going to show you verified vendor going to show you the mug here is actually talking about 1000 pieces that's the moq here is talking about two pieces here also two pieces okay let's check this um supplier who, who actually have two pieces moq and it's with uh two years and it's verified okay here for this actual bag we have like 27 buyers already this person have sold like 
these bags to over 22 pe 27 people one thing i want you to do here in alibaba that make sure you know more about this supplier before making any transaction with this supplier okay because a lot of people we have scammers everywhere okay so you can check if this supplier is a verified supplier actually you have nothing to fear okay so you can as well visit store to know more that's you go by the profile of that very person that's the profile of that factory you see this person has like 1096 followers you can actually check here once you click on profile you can see reviews of that person this person has like 111 reviews satisfied total employees 5 to 10 trading company north america location you check a lot like a lot okay you also can have access to check other product that actually this supplier supplies okay you can also check home of this supplier okay so let's just say maybe you want to actually you can chat here you see you can actually click on chat to actually chat with this supplier directly you can actually chat with this person not compulsory that maybe you have a specific product to order let's just say you click on chat now and you'll be like hello there this product is actually popping out you can click on send on the product so the person might think as if it's actually this product you're talking about or you can as well just send the person a message and the person will ask you what exactly do you want and this and that before you know conversation starts up before you know if you actually want to ask that person if he has a wechat account or, or details or we, uh, whatsapp number to add up with that person you can go ahead okay and um you can as well just search for let's say sleepers For women sorry sleepers for women women sleepers okay women sleepers let's go on this one is 50 pairs like um, sorry not to waste your time we're actually looking for something we can work with actually okay let's work with this high heel right <laughs> should we work with this high heel who is this person this person is not verified you see i'm opting out because i can't find any suitable um definition about that person so let's check about this person we have three buyers uh nothing good about this person you can just as well search just the way i'm doing okay let's say you're searching for handbags Hmm. Let's see. Hand bags. Are we on that supplier or sorry guys? Okay, we're on the product. So you either use the camera or you type in hand bags for ladies 2021 20, okay so it's actually going to show you some varieties of bags here you get uh let's click on this and see who actually this person is this person actually has a two years this person is actually there are actually some suppliers who are not really verified but are trustworthy it okay so it's not compulsory that a supplier must just be verified before yes we want a supplier to be verified first but there are actually some suppliers are actually worth it okay so you just have to check other informations aside from just being verified because someone can be verified but at the same time you know so nobody's trust worth it okay let's just select any bag come on let's not waste time okay let's just select any bag okay i just want to show you something before we we'll dive into my inbox then i'll show you something okay like this seller for this bag actually is verified why right? is actually verified and transaction that that person has made we have seven hundred and seventy thousand us dollars okay on time delivery the person is verified 13 years of experience manufacture and trading company you can also um view reviews you can also visit store to know more information like once you click on this store you can come to profile to know more about this person this actual um, factory to know more about these people their certificates ways of response a lot like you can also check on the 
product that actually these people supply aside from what you you were advertised on okay you can also click on category to check here to see what actually you're looking for from this supplier if it's maybe um a briefcase a shoulder bag a diaper bag handbags you know let's click on category again and just use this supplier let's say it's handbags you're actually looking for leather handbag evening bags let's use for evening bags okay so this supplier actually have just one okay um uh okay um let's just click on this red and this is an example guys you guys can actually search for handbags you see varieties like different kind of um suppliers with different kind of um products okay so what next you're going to do right now is is either you send inquiry like hi i'm interested in your products professional factory new style blah 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 and you send and once you send it will send directly to this uh supplier your inquiry has been sent successfully it will send or you see or you chat with that person directly and be like hi and be hi just chats and kind of hi or send this very product um picture to that person and once you're done with that you actually come down to your message and then see that actually you you can check because i actually pinned some from my you you check this you see you just sent a message to this person and this person reply okay this person actually reply giving you a message receive i'll review it and get back to you soon blah 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 actually this is an automated message okay because of our time difference these people have set their messages on automation so once they're sleeping you see the local time over there their time now is 12 35 a.m while our time here is 5 36 p.m you see the time difference right but this is an automated message you see immediately we sent this and the automated message just saying hi received your message review it and get back to you soon so this is a catalog for you to view blah 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 and everything before you know you start diving to messages with that person okay let's use one of my supplier here you can see my chats actually these people speak english like they speak english okay we've been chatting with this person and to an extent that even this person gave me a full catalog details like a lot like you know instead of me just going through their their profile and everything this is a catalog to view and if you zoom each bags has prizes and blah 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 you know and stuff like that actually spoke with this person trying to source out products for my um a, a, a customer of mine okay someone who actually sourced through me okay so like blah 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 it kind of these these people are actually set them on first because i'm actually using all these people how to set these people to the top so that you won't stress yourself or start going down 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 looking for a specific person there are very varieties of people you might chat with and maybe you actually want one person to actually you know be it so like let's say this alex lee okay this alex lee right now right okay let's just say i actually want to use this person let's check through this company um profile okay how to also check this very person again to be sure of who you're actually sourcing from or buying from okay you just click on the way i did you see this person has twenty four thousand four hundred and forty two followers you click on profile to actually see more about these people you see this person has 128 received um reviews and set satisfied okay this person has four years experience on alibaba the products that this person actually sells you see different product that actually this person sells hair and lots hair clothes synthetic hair clothes and blah 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 you can also come to home to see actually other products that this very supplier has this is mr joe james okay sales manager okay you can check a lot like okay you can actually chat once you're chatting you're actually chatting with this person directly joe james you see you're actually chatting with this person directly you know i've been chatting i've been working with this person for long and stuff like that okay sourcing products for some of my clients through this person okay so now you want to make this alex lee who is joe james you actually want to sorry this alex lee was referred to me by joe james okay they are same company okay they are same company i think joe james is at top of my um list already so there is no need to but let's for showing sake let me show you what i actually wanted to explain to you you see like i said if you're chatting you're actually chatting with this person joe james lee okay so he actually rescheduled someone like he made someone to attend to me instead of him because he was busy that is where i had alex lee but it's of the same 
company, the same factory, okay, the same um, suppliers, okay, this person was actually referred to me by Joe James, okay. So now let's say I want to make this person part of my top uh, list for me to save time of scrolling, looking for this person. I'll just click on here that looks like a, a human face here. After the call sign, you click on it. You see, Alex, Lee, chat documents. You can check chat documents. Maybe the person sends you a link or whatever. So pin to top. Once you are pinning this person, clicking on pin to top, you see success. It showed success. There is no need for you to then start going down looking for this uh, Alex Lee. You won't find. Instead, you come, scroll up. You find this person at the top among the list of people you've pinned up. You see, Alex Lee is here. You can see Alex Lee is here. Some of your importation tutors won't really go deep into this, okay? This is Alex Lee, okay? So once, the next step here is how to actually uh, source a product from Alibaba directly without the need of dragging that person's chat, um, WhatsApp account down to your WhatsApp or WeChat, okay? So let's just say there, this is a product here. Uh, let's say these are products we actually want to source for. Let's click on these bags, okay? We actually want to source for this bag, right we have 96 buyers okay and this person is verified okay chat this person hi you actually chat sorry you actually chat this person hi okay or hello and send sorry for the call interruption okay i apologize i'm so sorry about that so you send and the person will actually respond to you according to this bag and you see the mug for this bag is two pieces okay two pieces that's the exact mug for this bag okay so right now before then maybe you just want to order directly without even maybe you know the person already but you you've sourced from them maybe you just saw this very product you also want to order what you're now going to do here is you're just going to go directly and then um right click on the so guys um like i was saying right so here this is on like 1688.com okay so here we're going to click on the product to purchase like okay so instead of chatting you click on get sample okay so they are the only available sample here is black red and blue okay let's see one red two um two blue one okay so let's see if we can actually order more than so here they said only one piece is available okay so here already they've already ordered notified you that these are the only um colors available and only three pieces you can actually get for this bag no any other pieces available again so here they say shipping fee to be negotiated so you see the difference between uh alibaba and 1688 i won't lie to you in alibaba you find products that are way cheaper than what you find in 1688 sometimes and you see prices here for shipping are negotiated okay depending on your shipping agent because also from here actually some of these suppliers can actually want to send it to maybe via a freight forwarder let's say maybe you have your own personal shipping agent and maybe you want to make payments via freight forwarder this is nothing like copying a link sending to procure um, procurement agent this is not 16 it is alibaba all you need to do is just to look for the specific item you want sometimes you don't even need to click on all these black whatsoever you can just send the picture of the bag to the person on chat and then tell the person the quantity of the bag you want if that bag actually and the color size and everything anything you want you can actually tell that person and that person will make an order for you either be it a receipt or sp uh, specification to tell you okay this is your request maybe this is available this is not available you know instead of you to even go through this and if you want to also go through this maybe make your payments and everything shipping and everything you know shipping fee is negotiated right there is no shipping fee added so three types of bags different color three different colors of three bags the total price is 22.50 dollar start sample order limited purchase okay 
only one available okay start order that's only one you can only purchase one so you see they say ship to this is actually uh uh should i say example i did for the previous class so you can actually add address that's your shipping agent's address okay you can add your shipping agent address if it's in china the ad, um, shipping agent's name the phone number the address everything every definition and then you send save once you save it will save like what i saved here okay but i'm not ready to add any shipping agent so once you do that shipping agent address so once you do that it will show like this place where you have shipped to fiki empire blah 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 and stuff like that okay so here you have um where the specification of what you ordered which is seven dollar that's seven point fifty dollar that's the subtotal this is actually what you're paying for right seven dollar i'm just showing you guys example okay so product price 7.50 shipping cost negotiate uh, they said it's going to be negotiated okay so guaranteed dispatch within seven days okay so this is going to be dispatched in seven days down to your shipping agent so if your shipping agents shipping days are five to seven you just have to calculate 14 days to arrive to you okay so this is the total amount you're paying total amount that's um shipping to the address but because our address is not um because our address is not uh um correct and because uh we haven't have anything pertaining um shipping and whatsoever you know so you see this is shipping costs okay by dhl and blah 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 you know you can as well just ignore this because you're actually not using any shipping uh you see like if you're using any shipping method maybe you want by dhl or any other shipping agent or maybe fedex Maybe you want to use by FedEx, you see, the shipping rate will just be increasing and blah, 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 depending on what you want, okay? But right now, we are not using a, a shipping, uh, we're not using a, a shipping cost or whatsoever, okay? What you're going to do next now is you place sample order. This transaction fee charges, okay? You place sample order so here is going to say card number please enter your card number name on card fiki empire expiring date blah 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 this is this this is that and then you pay now card number is supposed to be your debit card okay but because i'm not ready to make payments for this this is this guys this is it so once you make payments and once you're done and you make payments and it shows confirm it will direct you back to this supplier's inbox right it will direct you back into the supplier's inbox okay so now <coughs> instead i would advise you sorry instead i would advise you to just chat up with this person this very supplier send that person the products which is the bag you actually saw tell the person the exact um you see this is a, a, a chat automation this is an automation chat actually this person is sleeping and this is an automation chat okay so don't think as if this person is online look at the time difference okay so what you need to do now is just to write to the person i need this bag blah 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 this color this quantity this amount and that how much is the total and the person will tell you total and the person will ask do you have a shipping agent in china if you say yes you can as well send that person your shipping agent address and they will tell you the total cost for a shipping agent it's also negotiable if it's so high you can negotiate the price guys and once you're done you make your payments you can also use a freight forwarder they accept it like you can use a freight forwarder if you if you don't maybe have alipay or you can't pay via alipay paypal or anything you can use a freight forwarder Pay to that person maybe if your shipping agent actually pays um rmb to your supplier or pays in dollar to your supplier you can actually add the total cost from your supplier then tell and um, pay it to your um 
freight forwarder. Freight forwarder are those that exchange, exchange do, um, shall I say, exchange um, rates or is it currency or whatever. Like you pay that person in, in naira and the person pay your supplier in dollar or RMB. That's that. Okay, guys. So once you're done with that and the payment is being confirmed, that that your freight forwarder will ask you of your <clears throat> suppliers, WeChat or alipay details or anything you know once you're done with that that person that's your freight forwarder will show you a confirmation of payments once he sends you confirmation that the payments have been successful you forward it to your um your supplier your supplier also confirm the next move is when to ship it down to your shipping agent and once it has been shipped they will, you make sure that they input your information your details a lot of things like this how the procedures is once it's shipped to your agent yours is now to start tracking from your agent okay but if you don't want to follow this process you can follow the process i showed you which is by ordering directly that's getting the sample placed in send in make your payments and that is that guys that is that please if you have any question make sure you write me down your question and i'm ready to answer i remain my humble self your girl rejoice see you in the next class guys thank you